As Marcus and Anne embark on this journey together, they merge not only their lives, but also their dreams, aspirations, and love for making a difference in the lives of those around them. Their commitment to family and community reflects a shared purpose that binds them in a love that is not easily broken. Human beings are the only creatures that have the capacity to truly love one another. And because of this, it carries a spark of the divine. It is God leaving his signature within us. It is why what we celebrate today is a sacrament, a sign of God's grace. Their union is a beacon of compassion, a reminder that through love, we become a reflection of the divine. As we witness the exchange of vows and rings, let us be inspired by the commitment Marcus and Anne make to one another. May their journey be filled with joy, laughter, and a deepening love that grows stronger with each passing day. And let us, all of us, as their community of support, pledge to uphold and cherish the sacred bond that God has joined together. Together, let's rejoice with them, be kind to them, believe in them, hope with them, love with them. Love never fails. May your marriage be blessed, Marcus and Anne, as you embark on this incredible adventure of a lifetime. It's so hard to stay on top of the world When the world keeps telling you who you should be All these people telling you what you need Oh, darling, only you can set your spirit free Pay attention now, I ain't gonna stop it, stop it Honey, everything you need is in your pocket Darling, this is what you've been waiting for Nothing is more important to her than family. Um, and above all else as well, she is a curator. And I think that nothing is more important to her than allowing her family opportunities to create memories. Um, she's very good at that as well, um, as we can all see here. We're all here. Darling, this is what you've been waiting for. One quality I have always admired with Marcus is his ability to be so personable. Whether he has seen you a week ago or two years ago, if you run into him anywhere, he will strike up a conversation with you, thus proving time is only a social construct. He really lives life as if there are no strangers in this world, just friends he hasn't met yet. Anne, you're so sweet and generous. We love you and are so happy for the both of you. <laughs>